Want to speak real Vietnamese from your first lesson? Sign up for your free lifetime account at VietnamesePod101.com. Hi guys, it's Ling. Welcome back to VietnamesePod101.com, the fastest, easiest, and most fun way to learn Vietnamese. Uh, in today's video, I'm going to share with you the top 10 companies in Vietnam. Not only are they biggest, but also their revenue is incredible. So let's find out what they are and why they are so big. The first one, let's talk about Samsung Vietnam. Since its inception, Samsung has launched thousands of different types of electronic products such as smartphones, electronic devices, laptops, or computers. Uh, the diversity in terms of types, models, to functions, and utilities has helped the business receive a lot of support from consumers. Uh, the total revenue in 2020 of four Samsung factories in Vietnam is estimated at $67 billion. Among the four factories, uh, Samsung Electronics Vietnam Thái Nguyên uh, achieved the highest revenue. Uh, reaching $24 billion. It is a uh, 50% decrease uh, compared to last year due to COVID, but two factories, Samsung Electronics Vietnam and Samsung Display Vietnam, closely follow each other in terms of revenue, uh, which are $16.9 billion and $16.3 billion respectively. Samsung Electronics Ho Chi Minh City CE Complex also recorded revenue of uh, 5.3 billion dollars. Now, next one, let's talk about Tổng Công ty Điện lực Miền Nam. Uh, the second in the list of companies with the largest revenue in Vietnam in 2020 is the Southern Power Corporation, Tổng Công ty Điện lực Miền Nam. This is under the Vietnam Electricity Corporation with revenue of 5.7 billion dollars. In 2020, Electricity of Vietnam EVN has made many achievements. Um, in Vietnamese, we say thành tựu. Uh, achievements in business activities, uh, constantly applying technologies and improving utilities for customers. But currently, uh, Vietnam's electricity industry is approaching the world's advanced levels of science, technology, and uh, management science. We say uh, khoa học này, công nghệ này, and uh, khoa học quản lý, in which gas turbine technology, which is an advanced power generation technology, is applied, uh, transmission line construction, and uh, 500 kV station, building a high-tech coal-fired power plant, uh, meeting environmental protections requirements, etc. Next one, let's talk about LG Electronics Vietnam Hải Phòng, công ty trách nhiệm hữu hạn. LG Electronics Vietnam, Hải Phòng. LG Electronics uh, is a leading global technology innovation company specializing in the manufacture of consumer electronics, mobile communications, and home appliances with more than 84,000 employees working in 112 industries. In particular, LG Electronics will focus on achieving profitable and sustainable growth in the mobile, media, and home entertainment industries to strengthen its leadership position in the IT industry while expanding its market share in the areas of home appliances, air conditioning, and business solutions. Uh, the next one, let's talk about Vingroup. Tập đoàn Vingroup. In the spirit of sustainable and professional development, Vingroup has focused on developing an ecosystem of six core areas, uh, which are real estate, such as Vinhomes, uh, Vincom Office. The second one is retail, such as Vincom, Vinmart, Vinfashion, Vinds, Vinpro. The third one is resort tourism and entertainment, such as Vinpearl and Vinpearlland. Uh, the fifth one is medical with uh, Vinmec brand. And the last one is education with Vinschool brand and agriculture with Vineco brand. Vingroup's uh, consolidated revenue in 2020 reached approximately 4.8 billion which is 15% uh, lower from the previous years. 
The main reason for this is that uh, retail sales, uh, we say doanh thu mảng bán lẻ, were not recorded due to the COVID-19 epidemic. In 2019, this segment contributed 1.3 billion dollars. Uh, so in Vietnamese, we can say mảng này đóng góp 1,3 tỷ đô. Mảng này đóng góp 1,3 tỷ đô. Um, now let's talk about công ty cổ phần tập đoàn đá quý Doji. Uh, Doji is one of the largest private corporations in Vietnam operating mainly in the field of gold, silver and precious stones. Doji's revenue has continuously increased over the years. In 2019, Doji's revenue increased 8 times compared to 2009, uh, 2.3 times compared to 2015 and nearly doubled compared to the previous two years, which is 2017. Although the COVID-19 pandemic severely affected the gold jewelry market, uh, in the first nine months of 2020, the company's revenue still reached 2.9 billion. As of the end of 2020, Doji's revenue reached $4.3 billion, uh, which is 13% higher compared to 2019. Viettel's most prominent product is the Viettel Mobile Network. Uh, Viettel Telecom is currently the operator holding the largest market share in the Vietnamese telecommunications service market. Uh, in Vietnamese, we say Thị trường dịch vụ viễn thông Việt Nam Thị trường dịch vụ viễn thông Việt Nam According to data from the financial report, báo cáo tài chính, Viettel's revenue in 2020 reached $4.1 billion, which is 2% lower compared to 2019. But in Vietnam, Viettel is still the largest fixed broadband service provider with 41.8 market share, uh, which is thị phần. Viettel's mobile services also maintain the leading position with 54.2% market share, of which data subscription market share is 57%. Viettel is also the first operator to provide 5G network testing services in Vietnam. That's why they're big. The next one, let's talk about Tổng Công ty Trách nhiệm Hữu hạn Công nghiệp Khoáng Sản Quốc gia Việt Nam. Vietnam Coal and Mineral Industries Group is a national industrial corporation of Vietnam with the main field of mining coal and Vietnamese minerals. By the end of 2020, the revenue of Vietnam's coal mineral industry corporation uh, reached around uh, $4.1 billion, which is 8% lower compared to 2019. But the company said that by 2020, uh, raw coal production would reach uh, 38.5 million tons, which equals to 100% of the plan. Coal consumption reached 42 million tons and also produced 80,000 uh, tons of explosives of all kinds, which equals 160% of the plan, supplying 122,000 tons of explosives and equaling 108% of the plan. Now let's talk about Công ty Cổ phần Đầu tư Thế giới Di động. Mobile World Investment Joy Stock Company is the number one retailer in Vietnam in terms of revenue and profit with a network of more than 2,200 stores nationwide. MWG operates retail chains such as uh, Thế Giới Di Động, Điện Máy Xanh, Bách Hóa Xanh. In addition, MWG also expands to foreign markets with the retail chain of mobile devices Big Phone in Cambodia. So Mobile World recorded $3.8 billion in revenue in 2020, which is 4% lower compared to 2019. But in the last six months of 2020, they focused on expanding their store network and continuously setting new models. Uh, strengthening their purchasing team and investing in logistic systems and operating support platforms. The ninth one, let's talk about FPT Telecom. FPT Telecom is no longer a strange name in the field of telecommunications and internet. Starting from an online service center with the first intranet product of Vietnam called 
Wisdom of Vietnam, Chi Tuệ Việt Nam. Currently, the group has become the leading provider of telecommunications and internet services in the country and surrounding areas. With the pioneering mission of bringing the internet, bringing connection to Vietnamese people, and the great desire for every Vietnamese family to use at least one service of the company, uh, FPT Telecom is making efforts to implement the strategy, bringing to a great experience for customers. On the basis of promoting the core cultural value of customer-centric and the foundation of FPT technology power, thereby pioneering to become a digital service provider with outstanding customer experience, uh, the best in Vietnam. The last one, let's talk about công ty trách nhiệm hữu hạn Lộc Hà Dầu Nghi Sơn. Uh, Nghi Sơn Refining and Petrochemical Company Limited was established in April 2008 with shareholders being Vietnam Oil and Gas Group, Kuwait uh, Oil Europe BV, Idemisu Kosan Company Limited, and uh, Misu Chemicals as a sponsor. So according to our data in 2020, Nghi Sơn achieved a revenue of 3.2 billion dollars but they're still the biggest corporation in Vietnam in um, producing and um, selling uh, oil. That's it for today. A lot of information, right? Thank you so much for watching this video guys. Uh, don't forget to like this video, subscribe the channel and visit the website VietnamesePod101.com to get access to your free lifetime account right now and get your real lessons by real teachers. See you in the next one. Xin chào và hẹn gặp lại các bạn. Want to speed up your language learning? Take your very first lesson with us. You'll start speaking in minutes and master real conversations. Sign up for your free lifetime account. Just click the link in the description.